Alright, welcome back to everything for fun. I really hope that you're doing well. In this video, we will talk about Solana. Solana is an open source project that offers a new layer 1 permissionless high-speed blockchain. In the year 2021, it was one of the best performing cryptocurrencies. Solana was founded in 2017 by Anatoly Yakovenko, a former Qualcomm executive, with the goal of scaling throughput beyond what is currently possible with popular blockchains while keeping costs low. Solana combines a unique proof-of-history algorithm with a high-speed synchronization engine that is a proof-of-stake version and an innovative hybrid consensus model. As a result, Solana's network can theoretically process over 710,000 transactions per second without the use of scaling solutions. The blockchain architecture of Solana is designed to make smart contracts and the creation of decentralized applications easier. Several decentralized financial platforms as well as non-fungible token markets are supported by the project. During the 2017 coin offering boom, the Solana blockchain was implemented. Its design aims to solve the blockchain trilemma, a concept proposed by Vitalik Buterin, the creator of Ethereum. Developers face three major issues when constructing blockchains, decentralization, security, and scalability. As noted in this trilemma, the proof of history, a sequence of calculations that provide a digital record confirming that an event occurred on the network at any point in time, is the core of the Solana protocol. It can be thought of as a cryptographic clock that gives a timestamp to every network transaction. The Tower Byzantine Fault Tolerance Algorithm, an advanced version of the practical Byzantine Fault Tolerance Protocol, is used in PO. Should you buy Solana? Yes, if it's a good long-term investment opportunity, and you're investing money you can afford to lose. If you understand that the price of Solana could fall yet further, if you're aware that cryptocurrencies can be volatile, and you're aware of the risks. So, that's all for this video. I hope this video was helpful for you. If you like this video, make sure to subscribe this channel.